Choices In the Mobile County Public Schools, when it comes to your child selecting a high school or career path, we want them to have a choice. These opportunities and choices are available to all high school students through the Signature Academies program. The Academies of Mobile County Public Schools are small learning communities that afford students in 10th through 12th grade the opportunity to participate in real-world, hands-on assignments connecting to a specific career theme. Through these academies, students are offered college and career-ready opportunities such as paid internships, job shadowing, and worksite training, all under the leadership and teachings of business mentors. For the next half hour, I want to introduce you to several students who have either gone through the program or are currently enrolled in the Signature Academy program and take a look at how this program has helped shape, sculpted, and guided the students through their high school choices and into a career. As an adult, we have all been there, sitting face to face with a high school counselor answering the question, what do you want to do in life? For many high schoolers, that question is now being answered much earlier and with much more confidence, thanks to the Signature Academies program offered by the Mobile County Public Schools. One of the newer programs that is being offered and attracting a lot of attention is Dental Studies, which is offered at Theodore High School through its Academy of Healthcare and Dental Assisting. When visiting the dentist's office, it's usually the hygienist you will see for things such as cleaning and basic dental care. The dental assistant aids the dentist with a wide variety of patient care needs and performs laboratory duties at the dental office. They also assist the dentist at the chair side with patients, and these are just a few of the skills taught in the program at Theodore High School to help students prepare for a future beyond high school. All right, to work on tooth number 29, I want everybody to go to tooth number 29. This is the only school that actually has this program, so I was really excited to be like a part of something new. I was also just really interested in teeth all, all the time. I always used to look at people's smiles. So mom's like, well, maybe it's, maybe it's meant to be. So I started and it is so fun. I'm really glad I decided to be a part of this program. Our dental program is actually very special at Theodore High School. We are the only school in the state of Alabama that has a dental program. So we're very proud of it, very thankful for Ms. Sheffield for actually starting the dental program here. She's had to go through a lot of work, go back to school, and get some different certifications, but we're very proud, very excited for everything that the Dental Academy is doing for our students. If they want to pursue their career in dental assisting, this class um, helps them tremendously. It gets them, um, it gives them such a huge head start. So you would want to hold your suction all the way in the back in the corner. You learn the tools before you go out into the workforce. You learn how to do dental impressions, bleach trays, all kinds of stuff. So you're kind of like ahead of the game when you get into college. And that's what the academies are for, is for our high school students to be able to get experience before they go into the real world, whether that be college or straight into a career. And our dental academy is helping our students like Victoria. She wants to be a dental hygienist. Well, she's getting all of that foreknowledge here in high school and not having, she may still have to take the classes in college, but she is gonna be so far ahead of the other students. So a major advantage for our students. So we'll get in the lab. I'll introduce them to um, some tools um, that they'll be uh, introduced in the dentist's office. They learn how to take uh, molds of the teeth, dental impressions, and for a dental assistant to take a really good dental impression, I'm sure you've been to the dentist, that's very important. So for a high school student, knowing how to do that, coming out of high school, that is a huge accomplishment to be able to take one and take a really good dental impression. Always have to measure it exact to the third line because you did three scoops, okay? So if you did two scoops, line two. When they come through the door, they are capable of doing it. 
uh, uh, they have the opportunity to take impressions, um, uh, see exactly what we're doing. Uh, we get to teach them even further. Um, uh, we show them x-rays. Uh, they get to learn about taking x-rays and um, chair side assisting. Um, I, I think that they're very capable when it comes to the door and I, I'm grateful for that. I feel like I'm kind of in a job training really and so when I get out I'll be able to do the things that I love and already know the knowledge about it. Now to see a program such as a dental program or a nursing program or even a pre-med program offered to high school students is not uncommon. And now joining me to talk about some of the healthcare options being offered within the Signature Academies program is Ms. Teria Moore. Thank you so much for talking with me today. And you are the health science supervisor for the school system, is that correct? That is correct. Wonderful. So what is health science and how can students enroll in these programs? I'm glad you asked that question. Health, the health science curriculum is designed for students in grades 10 through 12. Mm -hmm. We have programs at just about all of the high schools in Mobile County, as well as both career tech centers. We offer everything from nursing to pre-med, advanced health careers, um, in our therapeutic services pathway. We offer sports medicine, dental services, mm -hmm. uh, patient care tech, certified nursing assistant, mm -hmm. anything that um, a student plans to pursue in post-secondary mm -hmm. or um, in the area of healthcare, there's yes. something for everyone. So they're really able to get some hands-on experience. That's wonderful. Thank you so much for joining us today. So when we return after the break, we will introduce you to a program at Citronelle High School that is offered to the students exposed to advanced manufacturing industry with possibilities to make some big bucks. At Mobile County Public Schools, we believe it starts with us. That's why we offer Signature Academies. Hello, I'm Jordan Clark and I'm in the Health Service Academy at John L. LaFleur Magnet High School. My future career is to be an obstetrician gynecologist. With this academy, I'm learning firsthand from people already working in the industry. Shadowing them on the job really makes me want to study hard and work harder towards my career goals. Signature academies are open to all students in Mobile County Public High Schools. Visit mcpss.com. Hi, I'm Todd. And I'm Terry, and we'd like to invite you to join us as we take a look at nature in ways that you've never seen before. Come travel with us as we go coast to coast to uncover some of the most interesting animals. And some of the most beautiful scenery that's offered outdoors. You can join us on our nature adventures right here on the MCPSS TV network. I believe my child's school is um, probably one of the best ones I could have picked in Mobile. She's in the PACE program, the teachers are phenomenal, the principal, I uh, couldn't ask for a better principal. The research that I had done myself, I believe the quality of education in Mobile County Public School System is excellent. For me and my child, I'm going to stick with the public school system. I think it's the way to go. Hello and welcome back. Statistics have shown that about 75% of graduating high school seniors will attend college. For those students who decide not to attend, that is where these academies are making a difference by introducing them to various career options, thus helping them with a career readiness plan. To assist this plan, many area local businesses have stepped forward to offer job shadowing programs and internships, allowing students to learn firsthand about those careers that interest them. I really didn't have a clue of what I wanted to do. Like any other high school, I didn't know where I wanted to go, what career I wanted to get into, and I really just started the internships just to have a summer job and maybe to get in with some right, with the right people, you know, and do something different. But it actually helped me decide what I wanted to do. Audit Company started came to us with they wanted 15 internships. They wanted a way to get into the community and start pulling those workers into the community, and they felt like an internship program was a great way to start that. Well, for one, the money would be good for the summer, but then I also looked at the opportunities for like, you know, maybe future employment or being able to save up enough money to go to college with. So I just went kind of blind into the program. When you 
you start looking at how this this program develops the children and puts them straight into the workforce uh, into good paying jobs and it allows these students to become full-time residents of Trinell. It allows them to have the funds available to purchase homes here in our town, they're purchasing vehicles and they're making huge purchases that in turn affects the economics here in Citronelle. To date, that has impacted this community uh, to the tune of $1.5 million. So it has made a tremendous impact. Other businesses are watching what Auto Company are doing. They're watching how they're training these students for years. And then by the time these students graduate, they're ready to join the workforce. With us going through the internship program, we already have the safety training. We already have experience and we're constantly, we have mentors, we're constantly watched and we're constantly learning. Um, we automatically have a better chance because we, we're familiar with the men. The Signature Academy has allowed our students uh, here at Citronelle to learn skills and trades that they would, you know, may have to go off to trade school or into college to get those skills, uh, but they're able to get those right here at home. They're able to apply those skills right here in our community. Uh, when they apply those uh, skills in our community, in turn offers them opportunities for employment that uh, they wouldn't other, otherwise have and it's just uh, really been a great asset to our community. Now Auto Kung Fu isn't the only business that has a detailed partnership with the Mobile County Public Schools. There is also the maritime and shipbuilding industry with companies such as Huntington English Shipbuilding and Austell USA forging partnerships as a means to hopefully add to their ever-growing workforce needs. Every academy has a partner, and those partners have come on board to help our students become better. Um, so one of the things that they wanted to do was allow our students to be able to go on the job and learn some of those experiences before they get out of high school. We build aluminum vessels. Uh, and we partner with uh, Williamson High School. Uh, Williamson High School is our maritime academy and uh, our goal is for Williamson High School to become pretty much the pipeline for us uh, for our future employees at all school. We actually take them on to our ships so they can see firsthand um, the type of ships that we build and the types of ships that they'll be building if they decide to pursue a career at all school. Uh, we try to build a relationship with them uh, making sure that they have the supplies that they need here at the school. And we, we work very close with the instructor um, because what students don't realize is once they apply for a job, the only people that we have to talk to for references are their teachers. So we want to make sure that the students are doing what they need to do, showing up to class on time, working hard, um, showing up every day, not playing on their cell phones, taking safety serious, you know, just all of the necessary things that they need to just be successful, period, is very important to us just to build the foundation that we're looking for um, in, in future employees. Cause it, it's something I could see myself doing in the future, so I'm like, if I want the job, I got to make sure I get it so I can learn that skill. So that's, that's something I want to do when I get out of high school, go, go back to Austin. Uh, so we'll walk on out here and I'll show you what you're going to be doing today, okay? This partnership, I think, is a great partnership because it allows someone from that engineering field that has real life experience to go into the school to talk to the kids about what it takes to be a successful engineer, um, what you need to be good in in school, what you need to work on. I just feel like I've gained so much that what, that's what really pushed me to say, oh, I want to do engineering. I really want to work in the engineering field and that's what I want to study when I go to college. So that what really gave my push and my boost to say that's what, that's what I want to do in life. Well, Abby's going to be working with you today. Well, they came in with a, with a want to learn, um, asked very good questions, they're very attentive. Um, and you could tell because when I would go around and talk to our employees, you know, here on the floor uh, in the operating center, you know, how the students doing, and all of them said they're doing real well, they're picking up, um, they're asking very good questions. So everybody was were real receptive, you know, to the students, and, um, and the students seemed to pick up. Um, uh, real well and actually was able to learn some things about Alabama Power that they didn't know. This is Shaquille, go ahead. It made me feel um, like I was kind of handling with the real world. Like when you grow up, when you get out there, I felt like I was kind of handling it that way so I had to, you know, change some things, tweak a little bit in order to adapt to what I was going through. So we see just how vital these internships and business partnerships are to the schools. But what about the businesses? 
How are they working for them and how are the benefits that they receive? Well, here to answer those questions for us is Ms. Ashley Morris, who is the Contract Administrator at Goodwin Mills in Kaywood. How are you doing today? I'm great. Thanks for having me. Thank you so much. So tell us a little bit about the internship program at your engineering and architectural facility. This is going to be our third year to host an intern and we have greatly enjoyed the experience. Mm -hmm. We started three years ago, we had our first intern from Davidson High School and it's as rewarding as it was for the student, I hope, it was more rewarding for us as a firm and mm -hmm. for as a company. So we've decided that it's something we want to continue to pursue. Yes, so why do you have such a passion for this program? I went to a meeting, um, I guess I attended it four years ago, which Ms. July explained the need to keep talent local. Mm -hmm. So I, that really resonated with me. You've got all these students coming out of schools like Davidson that are remarkable students that go off to college and they move away and they don't come back to Mobile. So we want to help attract top level students to come back to Mobile and help build our community yes. and make our community better. So that was the importance. It, it lines up with our our philosophy within GMC, which is to build community. So it, it's a perfect partnership for us. Yes, and hopefully it continues to build. Well, thank you so much for taking just a few minutes and telling us about this internship program. Thank you. The Signature Academies program is not only about preparing students for a career, but it also helps students prepare for a post-secondary education. When we come back, we will tell you about the programs available for students on the college path. As a student in the Mobile County Public Schools, there are a few things I've come to expect. One is a quality education, and the other is a quality lunch. Not only are our school meals well balanced, meeting all federal nutritional standards, but they also have less fat, fewer calories, and they taste really good. Oh, and I forgot to mention, our school lunches contain whole wheat, grains, fruits, and vegetables to give me the energy and brain power to get me through the day. In Mobile County Public Schools, we are redefining ready. We are graduating college ready, career ready, and life ready. We are more than just a test score. We are earning college credit while in high school. We are working internships to get real world experience. We are welders. We are certified nursing assistants. We are redefining ready. Now there is a big advantage to enrolling into the Signature Academies program if you are a high schooler planning on attending college. Whether your child is planning on attending a trade school or a two or four year college, whatever their choice may be, signing up for these programs can help provide valuable insight into their desired course of study. Now he knew that he wanted to go to college, wasn't sure what you know, field or industry he wanted to go into. And I think that, you know, that's where, you know, his engineering class came in. I chose this academy as a freshman because when I came to Baker High School, I didn't really know what I wanted to do. I came to school, did my work, went home, went to practice, rinse, repeat. So when it, changed, it came time to choose a career, I was like, well, what am I going to do with my life? I can't just do the same thing forever because eventually you leave school. He now had focus. You know, he had a specific goal you know, in mind for high school. He had focus, he had, you know, some place that he could direct 
all of the energy that he had. It's extremely hands-on. Um, just about every day we're touching something, messing with something, figuring out how something works. I think it gives them a, a lead um, up against other students because not only if they want to go to college can they academically prove their, their worth, but they can also prove their worth um, within the field and, and with skills that they achieve through the classes. The students are presented with problems and they have to work in teams to meet a deadline to solve that problem. So basically the students have to go through the engineering design process and work through those steps in order to solve the problem itself. Me, I like to touch stuff, so that's, a, that's what engineers do, they touch things. I like to learn how things work, so I chose the Union Academy. But when he first came into the course, he was uh, shy. When we, when we came into groups, he was more in a supportive role in, in the group, kind of stood back. But then as the course went on, he kind of came out of the shell, and now he's more into a leadership role. This class has prepared me for the real world by helping me to understand the basic, the groundwork of engineering. Some classes like environmental science or biology or chemistry, that's not really helpful if you're going to become an engineer. Math. Those are somewhat helpful, but this class is what teaches you how to control the process of the scientific method, how to truly use the scientific method. I'm here with Ms. Claire Minto, who is an Academy Specialist at Baker High School. Thank you so much for taking your time to speak with us today. Thank you for having me. So tell us a little bit about some of the programs that are available to students on the college path. We have AP and IB within Mobile County Public mm -hmm. Schools. Um, at Baker I can speak on behalf of AP and that's our advanced placement courses. And what it does is it allows students to have the content with a little more rigor and relevance into yeah. their career paths. So the benefits of advanced placement is that students can get college credit for it mm -hmm. for free. That's you know, wonderful. instead of paying mm -hmm. tuition, um, they're able to knock out possibly a whole year of college yeah. in high school. And it truly allows them to transition better into college mm -hmm. classroom. So how do these programs work for these students and also the colleges? With advanced placement, the students can choose, and at Baker we have 25 different AP courses, oh, wow. um, mm -hmm. but they can choose which ones they would like to uh, attempt or we always tell them the areas try to be intentional. Mm -hmm. So what are the possible career or majors that you're looking to get into and take the courses that are more specific to those career goals or that major that you plan mm -hmm. on attending. Um, every advanced placement uh, course is different according to mm -hmm. the different colleges on what they accept. Mm -hmm. But the way it works is at the end of the course you take a test and it's a grading scale of a one to a five and usually a three or higher on that score is accepted into the university universities, but it is different upon each mm -hmm. university. Well, this is a wonderful opportunity for not only students, but for colleges to have students that are prepared to enter into college. Thank you so much for taking your time to speak with us today. Thank you. So far, we have talked about some of the ways that Signature Academies can help prepare students to be college and career ready. Now it's time to answer a few questions about the program itself. In a moment, we'll chat with the coordinator of the Signature Academy's program about what it takes to get your child enrolled in one of these programs. As Alabama's first and largest school system, Mobile County Public Schools prides itself on the high quality of education we provide our students. We have been successful over the years in raising our graduation rates. And have been recognized nationally for closing achievement gaps. We believe that our primary focus is to educate all students to become productive citizens. This is our commitment to them and to you. Hello, my name is Abby Dinkins. My children go to E.R. Dixon Elementary School. The education that uh, my kids are getting, um, they are, it's, it's tremendous. There's one time that I thought about homeschooling my kids because I wasn't sure, you know, we're new here. And when I enroll my children at the public school, and I'm just blown away because the teachers are nice. The, the curriculum itself is different. I believe in Mobile County Public School education um, for preparing my children for life. At Mobile County Public Schools, we believe it starts with us. That's why we offer Signature Academies. I'm Tracy Tran, and I'm in the Healthcare and Dental Academy at Theodore High School. In the Dental Academy, I'm working alongside dental professionals getting hands-on training from those already working in the industry. Shadowing them on the job makes me want to work even harder because now I know what I want to be. 
Signature Academies are open to all students in Mobile County Public High Schools. To find out more, visit mcpss.com. It's a fact. Bullying happens. Bullying can lead to serious physical and emotional pain. But there are some things you can do to prevent or stop it. Stand up for the person who's being bullied. Let the bully know that it's not cool to pick on others. Take action by reporting the bully to a teacher or principal. In the end, when you help someone who's being bullied, you are also helping yourself. Before we leave, we wanted to get a few questions answered about the Signature Academies program. And the person with the answers is Ms. Christy July, the Signature Academy coordinator for the Mobile County Public Schools. Thank you so much for speaking with us today. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Yes. So who can participate in the Signature Academies? Well, our academies are for all 10th through 12th grade students. Mm -hmm. Everyone is required to participate. They do get to pick the academy of their choice. Wow but mm -hmm. every student in 10th through 12th grade has to enroll in one. Okay, so how can they apply to enter into these academies and maybe where's a place they can get more information? Well, you can always go to our website mm -hmm. to get more information at signatureacademies.mcpss.com, mm -hmm. but in the fall of every year, we have a Signature Academy Showcase where we bring all 12 high schools together mm -hmm. for parents and students to come and visit and learn more about the academies yes. that are offered at each school. Yes. And so our application then opens and students in eighth grade, mm -hmm. we invite them to apply so that they can be accepted into one of those academies. Wonderful, so this is really preparing students for their future. Yes, this is about having conversations sooner mm -hmm. to decide what students' interests are, where mm -hmm. their skills lie, and to give them the opportunity to be involved in activities yes. that can grow those skills. Mm -hmm. I mean, also have them recognize, I'm not good at this, or this is not something that I want to yes. do yes. before they graduate from yes. high school. Yes, because in college, a lot of times people will get halfway through, yes. and then they'll realize, wait, this isn't what I want to do, but this is answering those questions a little bit sooner. Yes, and that's mm -hmm. exactly why we're here. I was in that same situation. <laughs> yes. And so the more we can expose our students, the better. We mm -hmm. also offer them credentials while mm -hmm. in high school that are recognized by business and industry. So we want our students to leave high school marketable yes. and with more options. Yes, wonderful. Well, thank you so much, Ms. July, for taking your time with us. Thank you. Well, parents, we hope that we have answered any questions that you may have about the Signature Academy program. And businesses, we invite you to look into the program as a resource for future employees. Have a great day.